So I've been shopping around for cars lately. I'm looking at like a few options. I'm looking at Mark IV Supra. Again, rear wheel drive, under $40,000. Hopefully the ones that are like really clean are more expensive than that. So I don't know if I can swing it. Looking at also like an E90, E92 M3. I actually have a friend that has a supercharged one. I'm hoping I can go check it out sometime soon. Also we're looking at a C6 Corvette. I've seen a lot of people suggest that. I've never been in like American muscle cars per se but I really do actually like the idea of a C6, like Z06 Corvette. They can be pretty sick, and it would be like so out of my realm. I feel like it'd be like such a new experience for me. They could be a lot of fun. So I've got to come clean. I did technically already buy another car. Let me explain. So I found a car that I really liked, and I'm not gonna say what it was, but it was so clean. The car was like basically taken apart. Everything was like powder coated and like refreshed and new. It had a built motor, uh, new trans, like everything. It was so perfect and I loved it. And so I bought it on eBay. I sent some like offers back and forth. We agreed on a price and I, I won the car, I bought it. But there's an issue. So the seller actually said that he had somebody else that was interested locally that wanted to come buy it and put a deposit down on it today. So he said in order for him to sell it to me, I would need to give a full price offer, which I did. So the terms were agreed upon. I had like actually purchased the car on eBay and I was getting ready to send the money and he sent me a message and said, hey, the guy just came by and left the deposit. I wouldn't feel right selling it to you you because he already left a deposit and I was like what the heck so long story long I technically bought the car but I also didn't buy the car so for now it's still just me and the GTR which I'm not complaining about I'm not complaining about that I love this car so much but I feel I feel like you know she needs a garage buddy she needs somebody to hang out with all right guys this is a Don a Don right yes sir this is a Don taking him for his first ride he made the best sandwich at Subway so we're gonna take him for a quick ride in the GTR Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> That's fun, <insane>. right? <laughs> so I was super hungry. I just had to pick up a sandwich at Subway. I'm and uh, yeah, so I came outside and Adam was taking some pictures of the car. I was like, dude, you wanna go for a ride real quick? So he's on the clock right now. <laughs> but man, it's worth it, right? Oh yeah. <laughs> my coworkers can tough it out. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. You're amazing, man. Man, that's what it's all about. Like, I remember coming outside of stores and like, just walking through parking lots all the time and seeing some of like the most insane dream cars for me at the time and wishing so bad I could just like get inside them or like go for a ride or something like that. I saw Adon outside taking some pictures and I like, I felt like I had to make it happen. So Adon, if you're watching this, shout out, man. Thanks for coming along and thanks for the best sandwich I've had in a while. Oh my gosh. Everybody get out of the way. I feel like I still haven't been able to use this feature like properly in a race or something like that. Besides, I guess I did kind of use it with James when I raced him in the GTR, but uh, cruise control, cancel, downshift, hold that down, rolling anti-lag, go! Well, some things in life don't last long, and that's exactly what just happened to the coma. It was online for 24 hours. 24 hours, and I got three offers, one of them being full price. Guess which one I took? <laughs> you know when you like do something and you almost regret it? That's kind of how I feel right now. It's like, I listed it, I just, I didn't think it would go so quickly, but here we are saying our final goodbyes to the Tacoma. Um, I have to meet the guy there in 10 minutes at the bank, which is that way. I've still got like June's car seat in the back here. I've got to clean some stuff out, but most of all, we're not authorized to park here. Okay yeah, guys, well this is it. <laughs> we're saying goodbye to the Tacoma. My boy Waylon just picked it up. Dude, enjoy it. I will. Okay? Thank you How so much. Have a ton of fun. Yeah, see you later. Thank you. Ah, well, it's a beautiful Friday afternoon. You know what that means? date night. How's your drink? Delicious. Just went and got food. We're gonna go ride in the GTR. Today's the date. Wait a minute. What's this? What is that? That's not me. Those little hand prints? Have kids, they said. It'll be fun, they said. I'm gonna smear their little fingers off. Anyway. All right, we gotta get the wife in the GTR. Sun's out still. Buns are out. Show me. Okay, don't show your buns. Off. After you, my lady. Thank you. Okay, let's let's get the full rundown. Okay, what what do you know about GTRs? Um, they're fast, they're fun, they're furious. Fast, fun, <laughs> and furious. I couldn't have put it better myself. So ladies and gentlemen, fast, fun, and furious, that's what you're about to experience right now. Are you ready? Mm, please don't please let don't. me die. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you ready? Ready. Okay, so we're gonna push I'm scared. this button here. Okay. This button Wait, here. there's a cement wall right here. Huh? 
Oh, you're gonna turn around. Wall. We're gonna flip around. Oh. You think I'm crazy? A little bit. Oh gosh, I'm scared. You're scared for what? I don't know. What are you scared about? Question of the day. How old do you think Amelia is? And don't be rude. <laughs> okay, give me your real thoughts. Um Is it like actually fast or is it kinda of underwhelming? It's fast. I feel like you could go faster. Oh what? <laughs> feel like I could go faster? Well, don't you agree? Do I agree? Oh my gosh. <laughs> And there you have it. What would you give? Give me a rating out of ten. Nine and a half. Nine and a half out of ten. Yes! <laughs> oh, that means she's gonna stay married to me for ten more years. <sighs> On another note, the Tacoma's gone. Are you gonna miss it? I already you, miss it. I didn't. I was against getting a truck, and then I like fell in love with it. Now it's that's true. She was very <laughs> anti-truck. Anytime we drive on the road and like somebody cut us off or like did something weird, she's like, "Look, it's a truck guy. It's the truck guy. They're always the the mean ones, right?" Truck drivers have a tendency of being rude. No offense if you drive a truck, <laughs> but come on, truck drivers have road rage. That was us. But after we got one. You liked it. I loved it, it obviously. A good purchase. So did you tell him that you got a new Whoa, 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 whoa! <laughs> Cut that out, Cut that out. We haven't told him yet, we're saving it for the next video. Okay, the sun has now dropped behind the mountains. It's getting kind of cold. We gotta get the wife home so she can warm up. We gotta get the GTR, you know, we gotta get the GTR home. Safe and nestled home in the garage. Uh, what do you wanna do tonight? Watch a movie, watch a movie. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, that'll about do it for today's video. If you liked it, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up, hit that subscribe button and the bell. And on that note, I'll see you in the next video. Watch a movie, watch a movie, watch a, mo watch a movie. <laughs> Don't put any of that in.